Okay, so last night, as I was praying, uh, I was feeling some very um, heavy things from some circumstances and some past wounds, um, or past circumstances that still have an effect on the current ones. And God was showing me something that was so precious that I just really wanted to share it. He was showing me how he honors the pain and he honors the suffering. He val it's, it's valid. It's a real thing. And these emotions of loneliness or betrayal or anger or fear, all of that, are very real uh, responses to real events. And uh, thinking of the example of when he went to Lazarus's tomb, and he knew, he knew that Lazarus was going to rise from the grave. He knew that there was about to be joy, but he didn't just jump to the joy. He stopped and he cried. He grieved for his friend who was dead. He acknowledged in that moment that was the appropriate the appropriate feeling to this very real thing that had happened and these very real emotions and the, the grief of all of his friends around him. And he stopped to grieve before he moved on to the joy. He's honoring the grief. He's honoring the pain in the middle of the journey. And when he gave up his life, he didn't just say, oh, just make it quick. I don't want to suffer. He let himself be betrayed by the person who was closest. Or one of the people who was closest to him. He let himself be in pain and agony for a long time as a part of giving up his life. He let himself be ridiculed, abandoned. He honored everything that you have ever gone through. Every feeling you've ever gone through. He honored it when he gave up his life. So I've been through a lot. I've been through war. I've been through domestic violence and having to protect my child from his own mother, who at that time I loved very deeply. I've been through a lot of things. And Jesus honors all of that. And he's okay with the emotions. He's okay with you sitting and grieving. Even if you're like, I sh why am I grieving? I grieved this out already. And yet now there's another reminder of it. And I feel sad again this evening. Again, my child's been hurt again. My uh, this person said this mean thing about me again. This wound got opened again. Uh, they're still not acknowledging me. Whatever it is. Maybe, maybe you got in a scary situation. Whatever it is for you. It's okay. He honors your feelings. And he loves you so much. He loves you so very, very much. So I don't know if you want to... I'm going to take communion. You can do it. I just want to pray, Lord, thank you so much for honoring the experience of this world and not bypassing it, not dismissing it, but honoring it and saying, yes, it's real. I have come to eliminate this system and create a system of life. Thank you so much for your body. Thank you so much, Jesus, for rising again and bringing new life and new hope that we don't end in the suffering, but we move on to joy. You are so good. Hallelujah. May God bless you. And whatever you're going through, it's okay to grieve. It's okay to be sad. 
and it's okay to rejoice when joy comes in the morning.